Hey everyone, Tip on here. Welcome back to Hardcore Tarkov episode 7 here. We have our Solewa kits all crafted up, so we're going to hand that in and then figure out where we're going to raid. And not at all, Tigara. 5 is pretty epic, to be honest. 5 streams in a row. Watching 5 streams in a row is honestly pretty good like that's that's tough to do i can i can't even get three streams in a row on most people you know i have such a busy schedule so like thank you seriously okay let's um oh we have new dailies too that's good survive a factory run what do you got for me just rubles and xp meh dvd drive and just eliminate scavs anywhere i mean these all kind of suck but their XP, right? Calum, how are you today? Welcome. Hello, hello. I wanted to sell a few things. We need to start selling to Peacekeeper, I think. Get some dollar -y dues. Get rid of that. Is there anything else I wanted to get rid of? Not really. This all has kind of a pretty good use. Yeah. We can um do the trick that we discussed before, which was... Buy euros from Skier. Use those to buy. Oh no, I thought you could buy. Oh, it's Ragman. It's Ragman. Use those to buy markers from Ragman, and then we could sell them back to Peacekeeper. Just kind of get that train going of to sell money. That's probably the best in in hardcore specifically, but honestly, that might be a pretty good way to do it in um. In a, in a regular playthrough as well, you know? Like, that's that's not bad. Okay, so let's look, let's go back to the hideout. We have a few things here. One, our shooting range is done. Very nice. Level 2 is going to require a bit, I think. Yeah, we're, we're well away from that, so we are not don't have to worry about that. Um, we still have all these things marked, ready to go. Uh, yeah, but we... Uh, I crafted this over overnight. I hit the craft button and then hit off turned off the generator. It took about 9 hours, so perfect for overnight time. Um, I might get one of these going. I don't think I need the piles of meds immediately. No, not for that anyway. Um, just to have some extra cheese floating around. I'm going to turn that off. That only takes five hours, but like, we're not crafting another one for a while and I could turn that back on if I need to. So just let that, let that roll, let that do its thing. But now we should be able to hand in this. Yes, indeed. Very nice. So that unlocks this guy. And we did stuff we have to find a gas analyzer as well. So might have interchange in our future here. Um Yeah, I, I forgot he needed the uh, the gas analyzers to get back on there. But this is a this is a customs thing. And we could go see if that's opened for us. While also trying to get done uh but, but, but this one, the extortionist. Which would be good. So getting those two done, I think, is, is pretty good. Then that, that all leads to, like, these things. Um, we don't have a pistol. We might have a pistol barter. But I don't think we have a pistol. So we just put on a simple set of gear here. This is more for, like, traversing than it is for playing, playing. And then, honestly, I think I'm going to grab you. I think we have some PBM, right? Oh, no, I didn't make it out of that raid. Got it. Okay. All right, well, let's do this. And then we'll just do... That. Top that up. That's good enough for scavs and whatnot. I don't think we have any... Yeah, we, don't have, we just straight up don't have armor to wear. I will wear that. I think I'll save those. I think that's it. Maybe some basic meds. Off by one there. Uh, four, five. I don't have any splints, do I? No, but the painkiller can get us a long way. I have this split, but I want to save that for when we have an alpha container. Um, I, I think we're set here. Or we're set as we're going to be. Maybe I'll bring a grenade. Why not? Okay, yeah, let's hop on customs. Let's just uh, kind of zero to here with a little scav kit here. Nothing too fancy schmancy. Go see if it's open. Yes, make sure it's daytime. I don't, I don't want to do it not daytime. Um, and you know what? Let's start bringing markers with us. 
because we do have this task to mark. The the whole point of this task, I think, is to show you where the they are. Yeah, so factory or custom. So if we if we find that area to mark, we can we can do that. Just find the transit areas, which is I don't know all of them, and I haven't looked it up yet, so um, wouldn't be a bad thing to do. I'll see you right. Alrighty, here we go. Did a little glasses switch on you, YouTube. Sorry. <laughs> Ooh, do not like this spawn. One bit. Let's me get over to extortionist, I guess. But. Hopefully the person who spawned there is going forward, not backwards. at me. I'm trying to look at everything, but it's tough. Oh, I think they searched this. Alright, so somebody did spawn here. So hopefully they get there and they open it. Unless they're one of the jerks that just likes to throw it on the ground. Could also be uh, maybe we poach a fight, get a better kit. I just step there. Damn. Their legs look weird doing it that way. God, this thing is so inaccurate. It's unfortunate. Somebody threw a grenade. I could use this fellas. Armor and shotgun.
This might be uh, time to time to go. I don't want the pilgrim. It makes you such a big target, but it's so good for looting. It's so good for looting. But that's not our that's not our current mission. So Truck door's open, but I don't need I don't need that part. I need the extortionist. She's over on the other side of the map. Just hoping whoever grabbed the key. Uh, I'm hoping whoever grabbed the key also needs to do the task. That stuff's pretty good. Is that SP? Funny enough, um, this stuff's actually quite good because it can one-shot the thorax. Hey, Vara! How you doing? Hardcore's going all right. It's been, like, such a flat start to my normal, like... Usually I have, like, crazy bad or crazy good starts. It's been so medium. Ground Zero is a little frustrating, but, like, other than that, it's been so medium. Razadaz, hello. Befuddled, hello. Psycho Lizard, Hello. I think I said hi to Celeste, but hello. No worries, Varo. No, I. this is my first run of the morning. We have not done any uh, Axe Factory runs. We will do more of those. Don't worry. Who needs... Who needs proper survival rate, right? When raids go quiet, tells me that there's people who won are looting. <laughs> oh, fun. How do you fix this? Shift. I thought it was shift T. I hit, I hit shift T. Weird. I'm streaking. MCQ Mama, thank you for the five stream watch streak. I did find a tank bat as a scav. I spent 8.5 minutes trying to find one. Oh, bummer. I think it's dead. I think somebody from over here killed it. I think that's what that sol solitary shot was means I kind of don't want to be here. Or I do want to be here because they probably open up 206 for us. It's tough to say. Oh, no, it's still up. Okay. I'm going to start getting hit by this guy. They're very inaccurate for a very long time, but... What's the MOA on that thing? Probably horrible. Also, the lack of a rear sight is not helping. I know people say the lack of the rear sight makes it easier to see, but it also makes it harder to hit, I feel like. So... Okay, that's in dorms, so maybe made the right call there. You might have a better... That guy might have a better gun for... Taking out the sniper scav. Whew! But yeah, what is the MOA on this thing? 
Where's my MOA? 8.76. Eight pretty bad. It's, it's pretty bad. Especially with the lack of a rear sight. I'll absolutely take these. Gotta worry about player scouts soon. Guy's still up. These things aren't very accurate either, unfortunately. I do need that for the trade. No idea if this guy's shooting at me or not. We're good on all that. Fifty cal? It is. That gives us an out for the MP5 SD, but this I mean there's no way this thing's more accurate. I'm not even gonna bother. Much better. I want an alpha rig too. Well, I need that ghost bell clover for later as well. HPs though. Let's, um, ignore dorms, I think. I got a pistol as well. I do need the uh, the kills. With pistols. Even if they're bad, you know. Gives us a shot. Search that in cover. Or search that in more cover. You can you can change the keybind. That's that sniper scav is still up. Oh god, there's so many scavs there. All right. I don't think it's open still. Or I don't think it's open. Alright, so somebody took the key but didn't open it? Lame. Uh, ooh. This guy 
picked up a player's MP5. It's probably worthwhile. Uh, honestly, the Keter might be easier to work with, but... I think it's two green teas you need. Hmm. We'll keep the full one of those. That can stack. Can also go into here. I mean, this cat is probably all right. It's just it's an ammo thing as well. But we might as well take a take two full mags. We're gonna take them. I guess we could also get rid of you. Get rid of you. Can't fold it up while it's in there. Why can't I fold this? That's weird. Oh, maybe because of this stupid thing. That's what it was. All right. All right, there's some still some scabs that way. Uh, I guess I could go check dorms. There was some fighting over there. It's not like we're... I mean, we're risking stuff by going this way. We could just get out with our stuff. But... My take is that dorms is probably empty now. I think we're going to go for it. Because I think that was the same person I heard fighting in dorms. We just need to go in the back of two. And see what we can find. I did not kill this scav. I don't think I killed this scav. Go take the big boy bag. People might mistake me for um, scavs. Uh, we have a big enough bag as it is. I don't think going back to dorms when the raid is empty is greed, though. <clears throat> I think that's our highest chance for it to be opened without the key, you know. Maybe, maybe on our way back we'll pick up that pilgrim. On our way back to extract, this is this is a scenario where I do wish I had brought money for the car. A new underground section on customs. Uh, define how new. Like, as of this wipe, or just you haven't seen it since you last played? I'll try to catch up. Uh, Jordy, how are you? I'm going to try to catch up on chat here. In a second. Damn, nobody opened up 206 either. Sucks. Check filing cabinets for that. What do you have? Oh, you're just a scav. Sniper rifles are good to have early, though. Alright. I think it's time we ditch the Keter Dreams and take these for later. I guess we could ditch this Keter, too. I could put I could put that on instead of armor, but that's a tough call too. It's probably pretty good to drink. 
Alright, there's our food. Juice of some sort, maybe? No. Beds and dudes. Peas are great. Uh, we don't have room for that. Oh, so I probably try to take that out. So I could put on the alpha rig and put on this, but this is better armor. So I don't know. That's tough. Let's let's see if we can find the 206 key. Ah, oh, these have been looted though. Damn. Maybe that's what they were looking for as well. But people don't check file again that's often. PC equals meta. God. Did someone say green? Mm hmm. Trunk milk equals meta? Okay, so they were checking for keys. One tap. But it's got to be found out of the trunk of a car in the baking sun. True, but we are in summer months. Oh, my. All right, maybe we are switching to the alpha then. Oh, my, indeed. Okay. Um, yes. Yes. I gotta search that still. All right, uh, Ked of Dreams are dead. I want to go back for that that sniper rifle as well, because so we can put that right there in that slot. I don't really need that. Yeah, we don't really need that. need these so all right definitely want these and then I think we're okay on this for now we're definitely grabbing all these we should actually do it this way because that'll give us less movement speed loss which is kind of funny I'm tempted to take this 104 over this AKM the AKM has a rail, though, so maybe not. God, yes. Give me all of the PS rounds. Am I getting rid of something for these? That can't go on there. All right. It's fine. Extra helmet, extra contacts. Might be worth ditching something for. That's a player, probably. It could be a scad that sprinted here, though, for the for the shots. Based on how they're walking and moving, yeah. Uh, oh, that's right. This can this will be able to hold some of this stuff. Um. Hey, Aquarat. These are in-ear monitors. They have a much better sound profile than uh, regular. Does that work? Yeah, that'll work. Which 
just got to do it this way. There we go. Um, yeah, they have a much better sound profile than regular buds. Oh, yeah, Lady Pine's not happy with this mustache. <laughs> but this was a stream goal. One, one, one. Scared me. Freaking full bag, too. Go right under there? No. Probably nothing great in here. Let's go uh, up and around. There's, a, there's still a scav outside here somewhere. We gotta leave. Yeah, he's out there somewhere. We're not gonna worry about it. Might pick up that pilgrim on our way out. These are Aria Moondrop 2. But yeah, they're they're called in-ear monitors. They yeah, they look really good. But thank you, Var. I, yeah, the, yeah. Wife seems united on the no stash movement. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm not. I don't think this is my best look either. I've gotten used to it, and I like it. I don't think it's a bad look, like a horrendous look, you know. Uh, for me specifically, but I do, I do think it's not necessarily my best look, and that's okay. It's it's a look, you know. For sure, be fuddled. Yeah, letting the hot spots cool down after 15 minutes is is definitely a good way to play. For sure. Yeah, I'm not gonna go back to the middle map. We're gonna we're actually gonna do that. We're gonna go cash hunting here. Yeah. Well, it's funny. My Lady Pine loves the beard because it's so, like this is. She doesn't actually hate the way the stash feels. She hates the way this feels because this gets uh, prickly and pokey. Happy pants. Thank you so much for the 24 months. Appreciate you. Oh, I'm overweight. Hmm. Somebody's already cash looting? Lame. Yeah, I do wish I had a... Uh, I wish I brought the 5k with me. I don't even know if the car was up, but... Oh, right now, nah, strength training? True. What's my goal right now? My goal was to get... The extortion is done, or dorms two hundred six done. I don't have either of the keys, and neither, they were neither open nor could I get the key for the guaranteed spawn for the extortionist. So the other thing is just killing scavs, looting, that sort of thing. Yeah. Well. So when I have a beard, I usually keep my beard. I usually keep the stash at a less of a length than this. For sure. Oh, hoses are really good. Like, really good. Alright. No more hearing for us. Um. But she hates the, the, the... Like, this is probably okay. This is, like, on the... It's okay. It's soft now. But when it's, like, freshly buzzed, it's, like, very... It's very sharp. That's what she doesn't like. She also doesn't like the look, but, like... That's, like... Secondary for her. And my parents like the stash? I got a great chuckle out of my dad, who also had a mustache when I was growing up. My mom didn't. My mom was like, oh, cool. What's the only one to think she hated was the button chops? Gotcha. Oh, somebody was already here. Stashes are coming back in style. They, they have a little bit of... Yeah, yeah, they definitely are coming back in style a little bit. It's honestly too much maintenance for me. I like having to care about my facial hair like once a month. I'll just give it a little buzz to make sure it's not getting too scraggly. That's it. Um, But I've gotten used to the look. I don't hate it. I have to wear my hair differently. I, I, it doesn't look as good with the hat. 
you know. One chops will never come back in style. Probably. For sure, be fuddled, for sure. For sure, Aqua Rat. Yeah. Yeah. It's prickly and like it can it can irritate the skin and yeah. Lady Pine are are big make outers though. So it's not the end of the world, but it's definitely not something I want to keep long term. Certainly fun to do for a goal. Trying for a ZZ Top Beard. It's not going great. There. Absolutely, Aqua Rat. Absolutely. Yeah. No, no. And uh, and for people who've had long-term partners, it's it's also can be an important step for them too. It's just it's just not for us. That's all. You know. Everybody's different in the way they where they uh, show love like that. Back to regular death by today. Red timer overweight, no rushing exits. I know, I know. This is this is <laughs> now back to your regularly programmed scheduled thing. Yeah. Should be the next goal be reverse Mohawk? No. No. I am growing my hair out though. I have decided that I'm gonna not grow out like grow out for like ponytail, but like grow out like I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna let the sides grow out a little bit and do a part again. Cause I actually quite enjoyed that part. The problem is I think it only looks good with the um, mustache. How about a mullet? No. Although mullets are strangely popular too. We are going to the red extract, right? Mullet with a rat tail. Look, maybe for five grand, not five hundred dollars, which is what the mustache was. Should we set a goal of fifty one hundred dollar uh, tips? It has to be in the one hundred dollar tip increments, though. It cannot be anything smaller. Didn't even mull it over. <laughs> Never change my hair color. Yeah, for for a goal, Pump Killian. Not not for on purpose. It's way too much effort for on purpose. But we did, we did Purple Mohawk for 500 subs back in the day. Like, the first time ever hitting 500 subs. And, um... That was awesome. Way too much maintenance. Remember, I think a mustache is too much maintenance. <laughs> Let alone dyed hair. <laughs> yeah. So. It was one of the packs, yeah. It might have been TwitchCon, actually. Yeah. Oh, I don't think they're super popular, but funneled. I think they're just on the rye, or they're like they're people are doing them ironically, and a little bit unironically. But GG's, that was a great raid. Even though we didn't get any of the tests on, still a great raid. Got a bunch of scav kills. Managed to avoid some players. Um, upgraded our armor a bunch. Got a bunch of bags. Yeah, really great stuff. Really great stuff. All right. I mean, yeah, look at this. So many bags. Nice. We are actually going to be filled up here soon. We're going to have to start utilizing uh, proper storage here. Or, like, utilizing our rigs and such for storage. For storage. Not quite sure what I want to do with that. Let's do a required search on these. Are we are we close? I need two crackers. Okay, so it was only one green tea. Got it. So I need two crackers. And this this is one of the keys we need. I don't know which one it is. I guess I could do it, but yeah. If you were my play hardcore, hit a bush to let a player group pass that there was only one minute. And got tooted. What's that? I'm not sure what tooted is off the top of my head. I'm sorry. Let's fold that. Oh, yeah, we are running out of space, even with the expanded space. That's funny. Um. All right. Oh, the sound from Karma. 
Ah, I didn't realize there was a sound for it. Got it. Got it. Interesting. Um, what was I was going to check something here after that raid. But I guess nothing really there for it. Let's not bring that in. Let's just bring this in. Let's set something in it too, right? Uh, we do want to save this because that's a part of a task. It might be better just to use it, to be honest, though. Maybe I'm just going to use these. They might have fixed the bug anyway where you can't plant the other one. And it really can save you from a lot of pistol shots. Like, it doesn't guarantee, but it can be dang useful. And I guess the question is, what do we take it in? I mean, we got to save the shotguns for setup, for sure. So we could take this AKM in. We could take this AK. We could take these guys. In. These are good for other things. Uh, we could take this MP5 in. I guess we have some mags, some PSO. We have some Quake Maker. We do have nice PS rounds. I don't know. That's a tough call. It's a tough call. Mm. Gotta take something in, obviously. Let's just bring one of these. Let's let's just bring one of these guys in. Keep it nice and simple. We'll do that. And that. And... That. I know it gives us two extra stacks there, but it's like... Don't want to risk all of our PS rounds if we can help it. And then, is there anything to eat here? We don't need the nudes anymore. I also don't need this. I should have eaten a raid for metabolism, but that's okay. Unless we have to do outside of raid here. Beautiful. All right. Yeah, we're hopping back in. Uh, oh, no. I just did this for founded raid purposes. Yes. Hopping back in. Um, let's try to get these things done on customs. I'll see you in raid. All right. We're in. Wow. 6 a.m. is... Did they change? Uh, maybe because it's summer? They change with the time, like the 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 times are. That's weird. Um, all right, this spawn is terrible for us. Like pretty actively bad. My favorite gun. Belt too. Ten rounders though. Oh, uh, that's actually kind of big to get out with. Or could be big to get out with. PS rounds, dude. My goodness. Oh, 
Oh, I can wear the belt. Whoops. It's probably better. Didn't need those. Now, I should take this SKS over this thing. I'm not going to, but I should. A lot of scabs coming here. It's like, oh my god, there's so many scabs coming here. It's like the time LU got like completely surrounded. That scab just shrug off a headshot because I'm pretty sure he just shrugged off shrugged off a headshot. I hate how the gun goes like that for some reason. I don't know why. <laughs> I shouldn't. I struggle with headshots every day personally to a big deal, yeah. What about their heads? I don't need those. I can make room for that armor. We'd be just be super overweight again. It's nice to have armor. All right. We finally loot the jacket that I came in here to loot. Just because the headshot doesn't mean it's a head hit. I mean, fair. I would like to not be near that. Make sure we're on the PS one. Shift T, oh, Shift L. And then Shift T. I mean, it's worth money. Always razors, man.
has the big rounds. All right. I'm not happy about this. I'm not sure why I'm not identifying that, but here we are. Oh, that's actually pretty good. Alright. Need crackers too. At some point. Flashlights. What kind of rounds we rocking here? Probably PRS. PS. Okay, PS is actually pretty good these days. All right. Guess we go to dorms. Oh, this is open. Never mind. We don't go to dorms. Let's get out of here. Could finish both in one go, but the, the 206 is super unimportant. Also, I'm really glad I'm going this way. Oh, I hit spacebar game. Hello? Oh, maybe because this is open. Not going to dorms, by the way. This is just my cut through. Uh, the unidentified is a key is a gingy keychain. It's a streamer item, but it holds four keys, which is really good for us. Um, as it's harder for us to get a uh, key tool slash whatever early on. Well, it's a good for space and our. Uh, stash. I hate that I did not keep the ADAR. I love the ADAR. It's so much fun to play with. But, all right, that's all good. Let's put this on. Operation Aquarius is just, like, not super relevant. And we have so much more to do on customs. I don't know, believe that's there. Uh, I vaguely remember needing five of these pretty soon. Uh-oh. No, no. Don't you dare whip a grenade at me. There's, is that a safe there? Is that new? That feels new. Wasn't that open before? Huh. Neat. I mean, I'm not going to loot it, but... That was always open before, wasn't it? 
Oh, MREs I definitely need, for sure. That's why I'm not eating it. That's why I didn't eat it. And the MREs, I need crackers. Crackers for the key trade. This is not a great place to not have stamina. Point in case. It's a player with a pistol. Oh, son of a biscuit. I'm not sure if they'll follow or not. I just want to get cover before I start healing. Okay. I think they were like prone somewhere. And probably hitting my um my leg. But we have a singular focus here. That's getting the uh the flippity flip out of this raid. You know, the usual. Skylight Box, thanks for the raid. How was your stream today? What were you up to? Dash near small stream. Nice. I hope you had a good time. El Brandino with the 20 stream watch streak. Thank you. Ooh, there's a player right there planting. We're not going to try to get a pistol kill at this range. We're going to just live and let live and get our thing out here. All right, GG. Two survives in a row. I'll take that. I will take that. Cheers. Welcome, everybody. If you're just tuning in, my name is Deadpine. We're playing some Hardcore Tarkov. Nice. Another 5,100 XP as well. Yeah, we got a lot of scads at the start there. Nice. All right. GG's. Good stuff. All right. What did I get here? Ah, okay. So we we cannot accept these things. There's, there's no found in raid tag. We, we don't get to use them. So Prapper trying to give us stuff. Thanks, but no thanks, Prepper. And then I did forget to um, hand in this. Which we can take. So there's a good example. So these are all found in raid. So, nice. Alright, that was a very rock solid raid, though. Uh, let's get this going. Beautiful. And we don't have flash drives yet. Okay, that but that's totally fine. So we gotta start we gotta start looting soon here. This gives us a nice armor, which is good. Got to stir up, all that kind of stuff. Still have there. But we can actually... We could probably go... Probably shoot out Picnic, I think, next. We really don't have much going here. Like, we, we really just need... We need, like, these. We need that key, which can be found in really any filing cabinet. Um, stir up for sure. Friends of the West for sure. Um, I have another tag to pin in. I don't. Um... Yeah. And we really need these discards. So, honestly, woods is probably a good idea here. So, let's get everything kind of squared away. And then this is a big deal for when we get do get the uh, Holtz 4 keys. Super nice. Yeah, super, super nice. Put all these away. We are going to have to start stacking here, I think. Relatively soon. Um, honestly, these big mags aren't the best, but they do allow me to take this guy in. Which is nice. I'm going to be using these mostly on scavs, but honestly, it's fine. 
Like, maybe I'm just finding them easily now, but that's a, that's a good enough. Or it, it, we're not overdoing it, I think, with that. Oh, yeah. See, look at that. I ran out of room here. Classic. All right. Failed the sort. All right. Well, that's a future dead pine problem. It's very much so a future dead pine problem. Uh, am I trying to bring this rigged to loot with? I don't think so. I think I'm trying to bring this one in. Instead. So four here. This is actually one of my favorite rigs. Five, six, I guess. Or maybe five, six, seven. Something like that seems all right. We don't need to bring food with us. I do like having this split with us. Uh, we don't need these calibers with us. Or this caliber with us. Let's leave that there. Okay. Yeah. I think woods, woods it is. Uh, we're looking for stuff. And we're trying to get scab kills. Uh, so keeping it out of the way. Um, probably trying to avoid players. Maybe not. I don't know. Oh, I've, we do get a few ADRs there. That's that's nice. But yeah. So thank you, YouTube. That's going to do for this episode of Twitch chat. Do not go anywhere. This is not um, this is not a uh, end of the Twitch stream. This is the end of the, the YouTube episode. I record these live because I don't have enough money for an editor. Um, that's how it goes. But yeah. Um, Anyway, sorry, YouTube, thank you for subbing. Thank you for becoming a channel member. All these things really do support. Hopefully you're enjoying the series so far. We're we're getting a little bit, we're getting a little bit of wind in our sails here. Hopefully we don't uh, hit some dead water or whatever it's called. Um, but yeah, thanks so much for tuning in. I'll catch you next episode.